Hi kids! Welcome to Bahay Aralan! For this video, we will be learning about possessive nouns. What are possessive nouns? These are nouns that show ownership. For example, let's have singular nouns first, meaning there's only one owner. In this picture, it shows that the man owns a car. Another way of saying it to show possession or ownership is the car of the man. We can also use the apostrophe S form to show ownership. But how do we do it? We have to write the name of the owner first. In this example, the owner is the man. So, let's write it here. After that, we have to add apostrophe S to the end of the word. And then, we have to write the thing that is owned by the man. And it's car. So, it is now the man's car. Another example, this picture shows that the girl has a dress. Another way of saying it is the dress of the girl. If you want to use the apostrophe S form, again, we need to write the name of the owner first. It's the girl. Let's write it here. Then, we have to add apostrophe S to the end of the word. After that, we have to write what is owned by the girl. It's dress. So, we can also say the girl's dress. Another example. This picture shows that the student has a book. Another way of saying it is the book of the student. And if you want to use the apostrophe S form, first we have to write the name of the owner, which is the student. Next, we have to add apostrophe S to it. Then, we have to write the thing owned by the student, which is book. So, another way of saying it is the student's book. Easy, isn't it? Now, let us have the plural nouns, meaning there are two or more owners. For example, the laptops of the teachers. Another way of showing it is by using the apostrophe form. How do we do it? The same thing. We have to write the owners first. The teachers. And then, since the last letter of the word teachers is S, we only have to add apostrophe. Then, we have to write the things owned by the teachers. Laptops. So, another way of saying it is the teacher's laptops. Another one. The caps of the nurses. If you want to use the apostrophe form, we have to write the owners first. So, let's write nurses. Then, since the last letter of nurses is S, we just have to add apostrophe to it. Then, we have to write the things owned by the nurses. Caps. So, it is now the nurses' caps. What about the plural nouns that do not end in S? For example, the toys of the children. 
for the apostrophe form, we have to write the owners first. Children. The last letter of the word is not S. So, we have to add apostrophe S to it. Then, we have to write the things owned. Toys. So, it is now the children's toys. Another example. The houses of the people. For the apostrophe form, we have to write the owners first. People. Since it does not end in S, we have to add apostrophe S to it. After which, we have to write the things owned. Houses. So, another way of saying the houses of the people is the people's houses. Is it understood? Alright! That would be all kids. Thank you for watching. Stay safe!